Hello viewers, Angry Birds Kid one here, slinging into action. Whoa! Welcome back to another episode of Super Smash Bros. Ultimate for the Nintendo Switch. Last time we played as Bayonetta in the Umbra Clock Tower with Tomorrow Is Mine, Bayonetta 2 theme instrumental, and had a pretty embarrassing derp, but we recovered, we started the match over just because, just to have a fresh start, and we did okay against Incineroar. We unlocked Sheik, and we're going to play as Sheik this time in, uh, where's the stage at? This, yeah, Garu Gerudu Valley, Gerudu Valley, with the same music, Gerudu, Gerudu Valley, man, I gotta learn how to pronounce that. Leave in the comments below if you can, leave a pronunciation type thing. Anyway, dark blue and yellow Joy-Cons, uncharging grip, number one, we're going back way up the roster to Sheik number 16. Oh, Sheik, we're gonna face, uh... I remember we faced Bayonetta already, actually, so... Oh, look, all the newcomers that aren't Echoes are down there. Nice. Uh, let's go with... We're actually missing still a lot of characters between Little Mac and Shulk. Uh, have we faced Rosalina and Luma besides when we unlocked them? Let's see. Uh, because then we were... I don't think we did, so you know what? Sheik and Rosalina and Luma, two pretty nimble ladies. Let's go. Uh, Sheik in Smash 4... Was one of my worst character? Maybe I don't know. Anyway, standard special. I think it's Needle Storm. She's very nimble, but I don't know. She's she's kind of weak, like like knock off the stage wise. Like she's strong in the sense of combos. Like look at this, look at that. That's that's pretty nimble, but still. Uh, side special burst grenade, I believe. Up special, it's, uh, it's another teleport type thing. And down special bouncing fish. That's what it's called. Now I remember. She she's. She's not terrible, but she's just, she's better for combos, obviously. Like, if you were doing a team match, you could do, like, Sheik and King K. Rule. Okay, and that laugh literally sounds like Kamek. Uh, or you could do Bowser and Sheik. Basically, anyone who's powerful with Sheik would be a decent co decent combination, because Sheik could rack up the damage. No! Oh, God, you guys, we didn't show off Rosalina and Luma's Final Smash, actually. Oh, God. Has it changed? It looks way bigger. I got wrecked. Well, I killed your Luma, chick. It, the other side of the stage was surrounded by ice, though. I couldn't do anything, man. Alright, time for redemption. Yeah, I'm not great with Sheik, but, you know, taunts. Okay, so that was the up taunt. Ow! You know what, chick? Get out of here! That's what you get! Uh, side taunt. Down taunt. Taunt seem the same. Her voice seems a bit different in this game. Metal Rosalina. Luma's not metal, though. I will penetrate your shield, chick. Uh, yeah, if you have a heavy character with Sheik, then it would be pretty decent. But, yeah, Sheik by herself. Some people do know how to use her. Uh, her forward smash is pretty powerful. As you'll see. Sheik's, Sheik's pretty good, though, but at least we won. Yeah, she's very nimble. That's one thing. So, I think we actually have all the Legend of Zelda characters unlocked. Yeah, we do. We did okay with Sheik, I guess. 119 gold. 1 minute 50 seconds. Whoa. I did... I did it again. Dang it. Well, you guys know the drill. I got knocked out once, but I knocked Rosalina out three times. And the three times I knocked her out were pretty instantly, so... That's just the way of the battle sometimes. Sometimes it's the luck of the items. New foes appear, challenge approaching. Olimar. It's about time, buddy. And I don't I don't just think it's Olimar, who main theme Pikmin. I think we'll get someone else after this, but Olimar is uh this computer might be pretty tough, but I find fighting against him normally isn't that tough, because really, no offense to you, Olimar, but most of the Pikmin do the work for you, buddy. We're on distant planet right now. And I okay, you know what? I feel like unlocking Olimar with Sheik might actually be pretty tough. Cause uh for reasons I mentioned earlier. How did that hit me? Excuse me. Oh god, the waterfall. Take that. Might be low commentary because I'm concentrating. There it is! That was close, but we did it. Just gotta push him off the stage. Olimar joins the battle. And his Pikmin, of course. 
I'm glad all the main Pikmin are in his pose. So we're using Olimar next. That's interesting. So we're going to... Uh, we could either go to Distant Planet... Uh, or is Garden of Hope in this game? Oh, is it not? I thought Garden of Hope... Oh, wait, yeah, I see it. Yeah, there it is. Hmm. I think we'll go to Garden of Hope just because it's newer. Actually, here, we'll click it quick because I want to check something. Dang, Olimar was actually pretty intense. Okay, so Olimar, yeah, he's there. But guys, take a look at this. I'm actually going to show off some skins a bit early because I believe... Oh, wait, wrong way. Yeah, there's Alf. So he has another character hidden inside of him. I think next time we'll just use Olimar, though. Let let me know if you guys want me to go back to the different skin... Like, the skins that are different characters. Like, once I'm done, all the characters that you see on the roster now. But next time we're going to play as Olimar. And, uh, you know what? Since it's Olimar, we'll go original. And we'll go to Distant Planet with the main theme of Pick. Oh, yeah, guys. Best soundtrack ever. Environmental noises. Anyway, main theme of Pikmin, uh, new remix. What's the what's the original? Okay, we'll go with the new remix next time, but we'll listen to this right now. So, next time we're going to play as Olimar. And uh, he's interesting, because like I said, the Pikmin do a lot of the work. But he throws them, I mean, he has to command them, so I'm sure he does a lot of that kind of work. But we'll see you next time. Be sure to check out Sonic Forces, Donkey Kong Country, Tropical Freeze, Nintendo Switch, and Yoshi's Crafted World. I'll see you guys next time with the vegetarian Hokutoshin Olimar. I'm Angry Birds Kid 1, and always will be. We got two space-like characters on screen right now. Cool.